playoff action continues. It's game two of the Western Conference semifinals. For Steve Curry, Clark Carroll, this is Kevin Hart. We'll see the Dallas Mavericks facing the Memphis Grizzlies. A quick check now at the starting five for both teams. And guys, what are you going to be looking for in this one from Williams? Well, with him, what immediately comes to mind is the long-range shooter. I mean, he can knock down shots from anywhere, and of course, that forces the defense to locate him at all times. And something else he does is he's great off the dribble. He can take it to the rack or pull up. So as a defender, you don't know how to play it. We look at Memphis. A tough loss for them in game one. We'll see if they can rally back in front of their hometown crowd to tie the series. And Kevin, this virtually becomes a must-win situation because of that loss in game one. It's happened so rarely that, that a team loses the first two games at home and ends up winning a playoff series. Yeah, they'll be stumbling if this one gets away from them, no doubt. Having to hit the road knowing they need to win two games in hostile territory. But if they write the ship here today, I think it'll be anybody serious. Mitchell passes booming up. Here's Mitchell, defended by Bullock. Five on the clock. Memphis wants to get off a shot here. Offensive rebound. Half pedal. The basket drops and gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. If you battle for the offensive rebound and come up with it, you're guaranteed a high quality shot on a follow just like he got there. And that one misses. Grizzlies on defense. Need to bounce back from Wednesday's loss. You know, they weren't anywhere near their best in that game, but it was a really scrappy performance in the end. Somehow, they almost pulled it off, Clark. Yeah, they showed a lot of guts there, Steve. A lot of fortitude, tenacity, perseverance. And even as shaky as they were, they probably felt they should have come out on top. And the Grizzlies with possession here. Following the score by Dallas. Mitchell kicks to Williams. And no good, his first shot of the night, missing. That's not his shot there, guys. And uh, whether you play D on him or not, he's, he's usually going to miss that one. Pass the ball from the arc. And that one's good. That is not enough coverage. Got to do better than that defensively. Basically, no coverage. I mean, defense did not look very good there. And I think Doris Burke has something for us right now. Doris? Kevin, I was able to catch up with the head coach of the Mavericks. He was clearly feeling good coming out of the locker room. They were so composed in that game one upset, and he's looking for more of the same today. He said, we don't want to get ahead of ourselves, but if we could ever go home 2-0, we will be extremely tough to beat. No doubt about that, Kevin. And thank you, Doris. Here's Truman. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact, and he'll shoot two. Pretty bad defense letting the offense get right to the rim, but a smart play to foul once he was there. But you know what's going to happen. They send a message right there. Nothing easy inside. second from the line. The Grizzlies have gone just 1 of 4 to get this game started. Here's the screen. Williams attacking. It's to Mitchell. Off target with his three. Kind of a shaky first few minutes, guys. Five field goal attempts, only one made. And stolen by Williams. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Passes it to Ronda Dekumbo. With the lead pass. And that one's good. What a move. He saw a window on the other side of the rim and whipped it around for the immaculate reverse. Tatum blocked. Williams takes to Mitchell. Thanks, the dunk off the rim. Oh, come on. You've got to get the two points there. The basketball. He dishes it to Drummond. He passes the ball. Sinks the three-pointer. He has six. How about this? They're shooting 80% so far. I know it's early, uh, but offensively, they look great. Just under three and a half minutes gone here in the first quarter. No good for Mitchell. If I'm him, I'm looking to move the ball the rest of the quarter because he cannot buy a shot. Here's Fee. Out of bounds. Dallas takes possession. And now let's go 
give you a look at the players who have stood out by taking high percentage shots in the playoffs. Andre Drummond fourth. Well, you always want to shoot a high percentage, and that goes back to the kind of shots you get. But there's no better time than the postseason to knock down most of the shots that you take. Oh! You know, guys, if he does his work early, he knows when he gets in a good position, his size gives him the big edge on the glass. That's good. It's a great play under the boards for him, and, you know, that's the standard that he sets. It seems like all those second-chance points, I mean, they're there for him, game in, game out. On the wing, Williams. Oh, off the back of the rim. Deflected. Mavericks leading by nine. That's the ball. Feeds it to Drummond. Ball defended by Gominga. Just five on the clock. Here's Drummond. A chance there to push it to double digits, but it's off the mark. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew Conjack on the shot. Easy call there. No question about that one. You can hear the impact from where I am. The Grizzlies shooting their second and third shots at the line right here. That free throw good from coming up. One misses. The Mavericks have gotten five of ten shots to drop in this game so far. Right at the 50% mark. Drummond passes the ball. There's a screen. Tatum. Plenty of room to knock down the shot. Six points for him. Now I'll tell you what, they've been a step slow here early on. I agree with you. I mean, they're allowing too many open shots. They seem a little sluggish to me. So, timeout call here. The first for Memphis. Well, he's watching his club miss a lot of shots that they normally make, and that has to be frustrating. So, uh, I think he's going to call this timeout just to try to see if they can be more aggressive, get them to the free throw line. Maybe. Sometimes that's the best solution for them, but ultimately I think they'll be able to shoot themselves out of this slump. But in the meantime, maybe getting to the free throw line will help. Mitchell kicks to Honda Takumba. Gets it to go. Well, he's so hard to stop, guys, because he poses a ton of matchup problems for the defense. Mavericks leading by eight. Pass the ball. From downtown, there's the bucket good. Nine points in the game so far. You know, there's no better sign of how efficiently a team is operating than their assist number. And theirs are fantastic. It's just beautiful basketball to watch, Bart. On to Takumbo, passes Coleman in. Right through the D for the layup. Dallas has gone three or four on three corners in the first quarter, doing well from long range. Tatum, defended by Coleman in. Tatum. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. Easy call there. No question about that one. You can hear the impact from where I am. And a chance to catch up on some numbers here. Scoring breakdown for the Mavericks. Now they didn't waste any time getting into a groove out there. They're dialed in from long range. They've been distributing the ball really well tonight too. I mean a decent number of assists so far for them. And the second free throw, good. The Grizzlies trail by 10. Here's Zonda Takumbo. And the best rolling in. And another basket for Memphis. That's a nice job of getting the ball in the paint and burying the shot. That's exactly how it's done. Tatum. A feather touch on the finger roll. Beautiful. 12 points for him. Very positive opening quarter for them. The shots have been falling. You know, the shooting percentage would be nice if it stayed right there, but that's going to be tough to do. Here's Zonda Takumbo. Williams kicks to Mitchell. They'll get another chance. Drummond with the ball. Out of bounds. Dallas takes possession. 
And the Mavericks making a change here. The Mavericks leading by 10. Ball defended by Jones. Tatum. A three-pointer, no good. Rebound is going to be the focal point for them in this one, fellas. I can feel it. Yeah, it's a physical game, and so far the numbers show that they've got the edge on the glass. Bridges passes to Anda Takumbo. Sweet move. And good on the basket. Bucket. Some defensive breakdowns are starting to show up now. The last four buckets to last have come from very close range. And giving up these easy chances is going to be wonderful for the Oh, look. Gets it to go. And the Mavericks lead by 10. What a start they've gotten off to. A big lead for them, and we're not even out of the first quarter yet. And it's not just their hot offense here. I mean, they're playing very strong defense, too, guys. Here's Bridges. He hasn't scored yet. That, I'm sure, will change. Here's Mitchell. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. It's the tenth straight point they've given up in the paint. I guess the good news is they're taking away the outside shot. Well, you know what? It doesn't matter how good their perimeter defense is if they're going to allow inside looks as easy as that. And it's the Mavericks with the ball. Eight-point game. The jump hook. The shot is off. The Grizzlies have gotten seven. I'll go for six two field goal attempts to go down here in the first. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance to make it three. I don't know if too many other players Kevin, have his level of concentration offensively. He just seems to have that singular focus you need as a shooter that you know, even if a defender's all over you, you still just lock in and let it go. And I know nothing fires him up more than a huge jam right in the face of an opponent. I mean, those facials get him going. Don't discount how that can deflate the defender and the other team, too. Free throw drops for Mitchell. Mavericks leading by five. He gets to Walker. It's good from long range. Walker's got his first three points of the game. Boy, Kevin, I like the way they've come out here. I mean, they're shooting it well and with confidence. In the Just a good, strong start for them. They would love to get more of those. The easiest two points for us. And a fierce finish. Yeah, and that's exactly how they're going to turn into the lead, Kevin. Yeah, that's why they've got to tighten up their deal. I'd be surprised if the defense allows any more free runs to the hoop like that. Nice to feel. Flying his luck deep. Gets it to go. The Grizzlies trail by nine. Here's Mitchell. He's got five. Out of bounds. Dallas will take possession. Grizzlies making a switch here. Mavericks leading by nine. Walker with it. Jones covering. Back to Walker. Left side Walker. A double clutch. And the layup is up and in. Walker's got five points so far. These teams don't look like they belong on the same court today. Yeah, it's pretty ridiculous to have a double-digit lead this early. They set the pick. Outside, Jones. He passes it to Island. Six to shoot. Back to Jones. Leans from outside. Off the left rim and up. And you know why he was open there. They didn't commit too much defense to him, and you can see why. He has trouble making that shot. Inside, number 77. Off target with the jump hook. The Grizzlies trail by 11. Williams passes to Island. Nice two from Poole. Terrific job that time defending at the rim. I mean, it's not an easy task stopping that fella when he's headed to the bucket like that. Good job. They've made one basket after another since getting this game started, and you wonder, is the blowout in store? Too early to say that and go there, Steve, but it has been pretty ugly so far. That's good from Max. 
where it really does come down to confidence sometimes, doesn't it? Boy, Kevin, you said a mouthful there. Confidence, such a thin line, because when you're confident and you're feeling it, then you tend to knock shots down comfortably. Mm -hmm. But when it's the opposite, then you start thinking about it, and that's no way to play the game. Things you want to hear about it, huh? Yeah. Memphis moving it around. Here's Island. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle and a lot of contact there. The Grizzlies have made two and missed two at the line tonight. And he makes the first. And so he's able to get one of two. You know, they can't be happy about the job they've done from the foul line to this point. And you know, the coach can't be happy either. No, it's not something he can control, though. He can't go out there and make the free throws for him. It's really frustrating when you miss those opportunities. But it's still early. They've got time to get a chance. The Grizzlies trail by 13. They set the screen. Doubled by four. Passes it to Island. Reporter. That drops. 11 seconds left here in the opening quarter. Now the pass to Poole. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. Here's Jones. Can't get it to go. Domination in the first quarter. It's been pretty lopsided. Mavericks lead by 10. Game four of the West. And thanks for joining us again as we get set to continue our broadcast of the Western Conference semifinals. And before we move on, what do you guys think about what we've seen so far from the Mavericks? Boy, a ton of threes in that first quarter. This team really lighting it up, guys. Yeah, it's been an onslaught from downtown. The Grizzlies shooting 43% for the game. And a chance here presented by Gatorade to see who's on the floor. All fueled up and ready to go for the start of the second quarter. So on the floor for Memphis. We've got Williams, also Bridges out there. And it's Highland in at the two-guard shot. And it's Walker penetrating. He feeds it to a winner. Lock at six. Walker defended by Jones. And he's backed off course by the D. The foul call. He'll shoot free throws. The Mavericks shoot their sixth and seventh free throws in the game. And that one falls for Walker. both from the line. Well, you kind of expect that from him. You pretty much know what the result's going to be when he goes to the line. Here's Bridges. Pass to Island. Hits the bucket. Six points for him. Well, he's so good at recognizing where the openings are and getting the ball to the rim. Walker with it. Jones coming. This is a good pull. Left side Walker. Pulls up. That one a little long. The defense needs to play tight on him, and that's exactly what they did to force that miss. Well done. Really left alone that time. A wide open three. They need much better communication defensively. Mavericks leading by five. Second quarter, we're a little over a minute and a half in. And there's the foul on the shot. He'll go to the line for two. Yeah, he got whacked. Shouldn't be much debate on that one. Yeah, that was as straightforward as it gets, guys. The Mavericks have missed two free throws in the game, going five for seven. And the first one drops. Shooting 100% in the quarter. They've, um, they've made them all, taking full advantage at the line. Well, it's a nice job of really making the most of their opportunities. That one falls. 
so he hits both of them. The Grizzlies trail by seven. Here's Bridges. And there's the pass to Island, defended by Poole. Capello can be spent while he draws the foul on James for another point at the free throw line. That one on the limit. Nothing fancy there. Didn't need it. Nope. He is only concerned right now. Clark is getting the points on the board, and I don't mean style. <laughs> I like the simplicity. <laughs> uh, but there was some style there, Kev. It was a, a pretty sweet one-handed flush. We're now about two minutes into the second quarter. And here's Walker. Seven points in the game. From beyond the arc. And out of bounds as the Grizzlies gain possession. Andre Drummond's check in for Dallas. The Grizzlies trail by four. Pass to Island. Outside Williams. Memphis moving it around. Island passes to Williams. Down to five on the shot clock. Mavericks leading by four. And it's Walker penetrating. Cool. Again, the miss by the Mavericks. I'll tell you what, folks. I bet he won't miss that shot next time he takes it. Williams passes to Bridges. Back to Williams. The feed to Williams. Gets it to go. Williams has got his first two points of the night. About three minutes played so far in the second quarter. Walker gets a screen from Trump. Off the screen. Shots good from Knox. And the Mavericks lead by four. Defense just has to fight over the top of those screens. Especially when the ball is in his hands. I mean, he doesn't miss too many open shots. Here's Bridges. Wide open, couldn't capitalize. Dallas has gone 5 of 10 from downtown tonight. 50% exactly. Back to Walker. Passes to Poole. The pointer. The Mavericks rebound. And there's the whistle. Foul hard on the shot. He'll go to the line. Well, he brings a, a much-needed toughness, both inside and, and also setting screens. And that's uh, something he does that frees his teammates up for open jump shots. And also, there aren't many players better at anticipating an opponent's next move, waiting for his moment and then jumping in the way of the pass to come up with the steal. He's got that master. Mavericks making a switch here. second free throw. Even with the one miss, he still stretched it to a two-possession game. That's big for them right now. He's at the pick. Williams against Walker. There's the pass to Ireland. Shot clock at six. Goes up on the high post. Gets it to go. He's got 11. But it looks like he's finally found his footing in this game. His first quarter was uh, a real struggle, but he's got it going now. Walker goes in. Let's take a look at the players who have pulled down the most rebounds during this postseason. Third is Andre Drummond. Tell you what, he's dialed up his rebounding here in the playoffs, and the big games seem to bring the best out of him. Making a switch here. And so Walker nails both of them. The Grizzlies trail by five. Island defended by Bullock. Island passes to Williams. Williams has a screen for Williams. Outside Williams. Back to Williams. Williams. Shot no good. Walker with some nice deep. 
Well, if this game comes down to the rebounding battle, they'll be the ones coming out on top. Yeah, they've been really strong in the paint, battling the glass. Now here's Williams. He's had some playing time, but no scoring yet from him. Outside Williams. Back to Williams. And a foul on the shot. He'll go to the strike for two. Kemba Walker picks one up. Yeah, the defender draped all over. Pretty plain and simple. Got him good there. Grizzlies have missed a few free throws up to this point, shooting 4-7 from the foul line tonight. Come on, you're the baby, yeah. That's good from Williams. And the Mavericks making a change here. from the line right here. I'm open. Yo, 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 Here's Poole. And the three ball is good. Eight points for him. The Grizzlies trail by eight. On the Takumbo off the board from Bruno. That is good. Boy, that was a rugged screen set there, fellas. And the defense didn't even try to go through that one. Is a three, and it's rebounded by Ande Takumbo. Ande Takumbo's got his fourth rebound in this one. Williams kicks to Ande Takumbo for the three, and it's good assisting in the play with Williams. Ande Takumbo's got five points now in the quarter. Boy, they're knocking down the long-range shots. A lot of those same shots they missed earlier in the first quarter. They still find themselves down here they're starting to make some headway into that deficit. Mavericks leading by three. Cool. He's guarded by Williams. Pass to Bolt. Here's Cool. That makes it. Astonishing. He's got 11. He's on a nice pace now from the three-point line. One in the first quarter, and now two coming here in the second. Here's Williams. Top of the key jumper, no good. They're really getting the work done inside with their rebounds. They're not giving up too many second-chance opportunities, which is always important, and it's been one of the reasons they have the lead right now. The Mavericks have shot 10 of 13 from the free-throw line. First free-throw is good. Kemba Walker is checked in for Andre Drummond. Both free throws good from Bullock. They're just over 80% from the line now. Much better than what they shot in the first. Now Williams. He passes Bowman again. Island. Six on the shot clock. Can't pedal. Can't get it to go. And it's Dallas the other way. They've led by as many as 14 points. Doubled by Island. Knox defended by Bruno. And still there to create the shot, but it's no good. The Grizzlies trail by eight. Ande Tacumbo off the bench from Romano. No good from Ande Tacumbo. The Mavericks have gone four and ten in the second quarter from the field. Pass to Bull. Fires the three. Kept alive. Knocks the pass to Walker. Pass to Knox. Back to Walker. Fires from deep. And the rebound goes to the Grizzlies. He hit a 
three in the first, but so far has been unable to capitalize here in this court. Here's coming in. Gets the front of the rim and out. Nobody anywhere close to him. Where's the defense? He's got to make that shot, though. Here's Poole. And I'm not sure what he was thinking there. He's tried to get it going, but the shots just have not dropped for him today. Here's Ande Takumbo. He's got seven. Count the bucket. Well, he's been a real positive factor for them today, although, you know, as a team, they had kind of negatives mixed in there as well. Williams comes with the double team, and it's going to be out of bounds. The Grizzlies will take it. Way too loose on that inbounds pass. And the Mavericks making a change here. Drummond's checked in. The Grizzlies trail by five. They set the pick. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. Well, good idea setting that screen, but the execution wasn't there. No, it sure wasn't. I mean, you want it to be hard, but it also has to be legal. Dallas has gone outside a lot tonight. 17 times, in fact. 7 of 17. Ball. He's guarded by Williams. Now the dish to Drummond. Nice move. Five to shoot. From past the arc. He's rebounded by Ando Tacumba. Memphis has gotten the going from downtown in the second quarter. They're 3 of 3 on three corners. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. Well, his score in this quarter has been off the charts, and the complexion of the game as a result uh, may change. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. The Mavericks leading. This one for three. Grizzlies with the rebound. On to Jacumbo. has got seven rebounds in the game. That's foul number two on him. It might not warrant sitting in entirely, but uh, you know, another one before halftime, they could, they could be in some trouble. The Grizzlies have made seven free throws and missed three in this game. And they now lead as the free throw drops for him. Maverick shooting in the second quarter has been pretty embarrassing, just 27%. Dallas calls timeout. You know, all coaches hate defensively when you give up easy points in the paint. That, that's inexcusable. So that, that's the reason for this timeout here. I think it came down to the fact they were getting beat inside. And that's why the coach called timeout. They were not winning the battle inside. So it's the Mavericks now. They trail by one. The pass the ball. Dallas moving it around. It's good. He's got eight. You might not think of him as a laser three-point shooter, but that shot was there for him, and he had to take it. Here's Andre Tacumbo. Defended by Knox. No good from Andre Tacumbo. Great defense in the paint there, making it tough on the offense. That's what he brings, a presence. I mean, you saw it on that miss. Pass to Knox. Let's it go with a three. Rebound by Mitchell. And the Grizzly shooting in the second quarter has been superb. 58% for the field. That's good. On to Takumbo has got 15 points. They're getting on the roll inside. Their last three field goals have come from inside the paint area. The defense has to make an adjustment. They've got to string together some stops, or at the very least, try to force this team into some bad shots to the inside. A beautiful reverse layup. And it's six points here for Drummond. Now there's something for the top ten highlight reel right there. A layup can be just as sweet and as pretty as a dunk sometimes. Doubled by four. Number 35. Defended by Drummond. Number 35. So he gets the whistle. Contact on the way up and two shots coming up. It's his first trip to the line. The first one falls, and the Mavericks making a change here. Oh, 
No good on the second two. Foot. Maverick shooting pretty well at 46% from the floor. Passes it to Ball. Here's Bullock. Lock at six. And that's on a bounds. Dallas will retain possession. Just five to shoot. Knocked away. Memphis trailing here. Question is, do they go two for one here? Can they get a good shot in time? That's the question. On by Zagumbo, passes coming up. He's got free throw attempts number four and five here. That free throw good from coming up. Both free throws good from coming up. So it's the Mavericks now. Ball defended by Kylan. Here's Ball. He scores up and sinks it. Eight points for him. Here's Honda Takumbo. Smooth as silk on the finger roll. And the Grizzlies lead by one. The point we've seen the lead change hands quite a bit in this one. Yeah, we sure have. I mean, it's been a bit of a windshield like the game. I mean, back and forth, the lead has gone five times. So no one in clear control yet. I think both teams feel like they can win. They both have confidence. Uh, so we'll see which team can kind of ride the momentum and take control of this game. Second quarter ends in a tight one. It's the Grizzlies up by one. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the third quarter. But right now, it's time for the Sprint Halftime Show with Damon Bruce. And now, brought to you by Sprint. Round two of the NBA playoffs is in full swing. This is 2K Sports. The Grizzlies have the lead out in Memphis against Dallas. A win today would even things up in this series. And for the Mavericks, also a strong start. And give them credit defensively. They're boxing out, controlling their defensive backboards. Andre Drummond has been outstanding. He's picked up half a dozen points and is putting out the effort defensively as well, making his presence felt on both ends of the floor. And that's all there is for me here in the studio. Time to send you back to my friend Kevin Harlan and the crew for the second half. The Sprint Halftime Report, presented by Sprint. It's the NBA playoffs. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action here in this game, too. It's been one outstanding game from Andre Takumbo. Yeah, it's been sheer dominance in the post by him so far, just tearing them up when he gets inside. And getting it to him is the only hard part. Once he has it, he's on. On the floor right now for the Mavericks. Shots good. He's very savvy in traffic. When he gets inside, that's a kind of uncanny way of shielding himself from contact and finding a way to finish at the rim. And Steve, he's also the player they rally around at the defensive end. I mean, they cause some real havoc when he's out there running the show defensively. Williams kicks to Honda Takumbo. And lots of contact there. Missing the shot. He'll shoot two. This is his second trip to the free throw line. Both free throws good from Andre Jacumbo. And it's the Mavericks with the ball. It's a three point game. There's the screen. The pass to ball. Kicks it to Drummond. It's on to Andre Jacumbo. 
three on three. Williams with the ball. Now guarded by Ball. Here's Bruno. Yeah. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Williams. He's got 12. What a big time mismatch it's been in the post. Where's the defensive adjustment? They're getting house down there. <laughs> they sure are. You got to come up with something. A double team, maybe a substitution, but this is getting ridiculous. Dallas calls timeout. We have to like what we're seeing from Andre Jacumbo. He's been attacking the rim with reckless abandon. They're searching for answers. Some way they've got to figure out how to contain it. He's guarded by Williams. Here's Ball. Nailed from three-point land. He's got 13. That is his shot, guys. So you can't just give it to him. You've got to get up on him and get into his airspace there. Mitchell kicks to Williams. Pass to Mitchell. Six to shoot. And another basket for Memphis. Yeah, they've been so effective when they've been able to get the ball inside. Some real shortcomings from this defense. I mean, they've given up five straight looks in the paint. So look at the ball. Another three for Dallas. Nothing but money for them to start the half. They've made all three of their shot attempts. Williams passes to Andre Jacumbo. Backs in. He passes Bruning up. Here's Andre Tacumbo, defended by Bruning. No good from Bruning up. Oh, it happens. He's wide open, but just couldn't get it to go. Pass to Bull. For the lead. It's rebounded by Memphis. Andre Tacumbo's got rebound number eight now on the night. Here's Bruning up. No good. Now Dallas takes it the other way. And now we're three minutes into the third quarter of play. Goes back up, and the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket's good. He'll go to the line. in the third quarter, 50% from the field. Here's Andre Tacumbo. 21 points in the game. Gets it to go. Andre Tacumbo's got six in the quarter. Seven lead changes now, and we're just in the third quarter. Yeah, each side having a tough time staying in the field. Well, the fans love it. We have a tug of war, a back and forth affair, but if you're a coach, there's a frustration. You're trying to pull ahead, but Pretty evenly matched game. He tries for three. Can't get it to go. So the Mavericks will take it the other way. There's the pick. This is it the ball. Wide open look. He turns that one off the back iron and down it falls. 15 points in the game. Yeah, and guys, it's his consistent shooting that's really helped get his team into a position they're in right now. Now a timeout called by Memphis. At this point of the game, always important to stay focused. And while the coach goes over the game plan, these players are getting a much-needed chance to rehydrate and refuel with Gatorade. And guys, uh, we know the drill well, all three of us drinking the Gatorade, too. Yeah, yeah no right. Question. I mean, Kevin, people uh, have no idea the fatigue that can set in during a telecast. And so it's important for us to stay hydrated all game long. Clark, you're always hydrated. Yeah, I try to be, but it's usually um, with a combination of H2O and Gatorade. I love Gatorade. And look at Steve. He has the Gatorade shirt on. Yeah, he's, all, he's really immersed in the Gatorade. Yeah, gotta love it. <laughs> and Williams, here we go. And the basket is good. The call goes his way, and we could be looking at a three-point play. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the Grizzlies. 
Guys, their play close to the hoop has been great all game. And I also like the penetration. I mean, they're getting into the paint. They're getting a lot of easy hoops from those strong drives. That's important because this game, I think, is going to be decided by who controls the paint in crunch time. Pass to Mitchell. Shot clock at six. Vicious to Williams. Pass to Mitchell. On deep. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Moving up. Blocked. In this quarter, he's really been off the mark. He just looks a little bit unsettled. Passes up the ball. It's stolen. Williams inside, defended by Ball. And he hits it and gets hacked on the play. A three point possibility if he can convert the free throw. Well, it's been a poor defensive effort. When that ball has gone inside into the post, they've been in trouble. Yep, points in the paint clearly going against them now. And that one falls for Williams. Can you believe the job they're doing at the foul line since halftime? I mean, they've been perfect so far. Yeah, sometimes it's contagious. Everybody starts to get comfortable and relaxed and everything goes in the hoop. Moving the ball around. Shots good from Poole. 14 points for him. Boy, they've come out of halftime just smoking hot from behind the arc. Hey, trust me on this one, partner. They are going to continue to let him fly. Jones drives in. An easy layup after coming out the pit. And the Grizzlies lead by four. Boy, they are just destroying him in the paint. You could say that again, Steve. The defenders just aren't aggressive enough down low. Here's Poole. And they're going to count the bucket and send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. The offensive execution really well done. They got the ball in tight for the high percentage shot. And under the Kimbo's check in for the Grizzlies. Mitchell comes in for Williams. Memphis has gotten off to a very slow start from three-point range in the second half. They're 0 for 4. Here's Mitchell. He's got seven. He's gone one of one in the game so far from the line. And the first one at the line is good. Mavericks making a switch here. And Mitchell drops him both. Mavericks trailed by three. the tie. Here's Williams with the rebound. The pass to Island. Here's Mitchell. He passes to Island. Shot clock at five. On deep three-point range. Can't hit. Now Dallas takes it the other way. Oh, Linick with it. 
Pass to Ola. From deep. The offensive rebound. From deep. Tatum. That misses. Had a chance to tie it there. And the Grizzlies leading by three. Mitchell kicks to Onda Takumbo. Good on the shot. Onda Takumbo's got eight points here in this quarter. And it's the Mavericks with the ball. They really want to find that igniter here. Yeah, that's right. Kevin, the offense has basically been running in place. They got to get going. Tatum defended by Island. They get it back. Great defense that time from under Jacumbo. The Grizzlies shooting it quite well in this third quarter, 53%, and the offense is rolling. He dishes it to Jones. Pass to Mitchell. Shoots. And the Grizzlies tack on two more. Mavericks trailed by seven. To stop the drought. No good from Ball. And this is... Here's Island rejected by Island. Jones, the pass to Mitchell. Tries again. There's a good screen. A pass to Ball. Wide open. And he buries that one, drilling the rim on the way down. 17 points in the game. Mitchell kicks to Jones. He passes to Mitchell, defended by Poole. A 15-footer. Mitchell's shot is good. Mitchell's got eight here in the quarter. Whatever their plan was defensively that time, it, it didn't work. Not if it results in that shot. Dallas calls timeout. You have to like what we're seeing from Andre Takumbo. They need to make some adjustments because he's absolutely scorching. Andre Drummond's checked in for Dallas. And it's the Mavericks with the ball. They trail by seven. Here's Poole. And out of bounds as the Grizzlies gain possession. the Grizzlies leading by seven. Here's Onda Takumbo. He's got 25. Gets it to go. Onda Takumbo's got 27 points. They're in the position they're in right now thanks in no small part to the show that he's putting on in this period. Here's Poole. Here's the jump shot. 19 points in the game. Not really the shot they were looking for, but still they got it to go. Here's Ande Takumbo. 27 points for him. The finger roll finish at the bucket. And the Grizzlies lead by nine. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. They keep getting in the paint and keep scoring points. Keep it going. And not a lot you can do defensively when they continue to get the ball inside and get these easy shots. Backing down is Drummond. Another shot. Great deep that time from Andre Takumbo. This is why you need size inside. The ability to contest shots and force misses. Steve, that's exactly right. Even when you get in close, it's still a tough shot. Ball, the basket pool. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. And these are his second and third free throws tonight. First one falls for. And the Mavericks making a change here.
free throw is good from Poole. And the Grizzlies leading by seven. Here's Mitchell. And he threw the block in foul. He'll go to the line for two. He is three for three from the free throw line. change here. And Mitchell drops them both. 40 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. It's tipped. Stolen by Mitchell. Pass to Bridges. And he drops him away up off the glass. Bridges has got his second bucket of the night. Mavericks trailed by 11. Ball defended by Bridges. Ooh, tough break for the defense. He took the heat and drew the whistle. Yep, but when you get there late, that's what happens. points in the game. With one on the clock, we got a good time, but it wouldn't fall for him. Well, it's been an exciting game. Plenty of offense as we head to the fourth quarter. Grizzlies lead by nine. And we'll have the start of the fourth quarter for you as soon as we get back from this short break. Game 4 Eastern Semifinals, the Chicago Bulls, next Tuesday, 7 o'clock Eastern. Hello and thanks for joining us, folks. The fourth quarter of play should begin momentarily. Mavericks trailed by nine. Bridges out there with Mitchell. Then it's Williams. And it's rolling in at the three spot. That's the lineup in the game for Memphis. And no question, he got bumped on that shot. Definitely no room for discussion on that one. Checked in for Mitchell. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. Out of bounds, Dallas takes possession. Well, that's inexcusable to throw a pass that far off the mark. And the Grizzlies making a change here. Mitchell's checked in. Here's Bullock. Passes it to Ball. Tatum. And it's wide right. It's off the rim. 
And it is very dangerous to leave him open like that. Lucky break for the defense that he missed it. Rejected by ball. But they get it there. Outside Williams. Four on the clock. Good. And the Grizzlies lead by nine. He's had an off game thus far, but his team has been able to pick up the slack and find a way to get it done here. Ball. He's guarded by Williams. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. change here. And he's good on the second. Fourth quarter just getting started. One minute in the books. And the Grizzlies leading by eight. Here's Mitchell. Here's the pass. Pulling up. The feather touch on the finger roll. Beautiful. For the drive to the bucket was nice. The finger roll first. Beautiful. Pass the two. Feeds to Jenny. And he uses the glass on the lane. And we've made our way through just over a minute and a half in this fourth quarter. Williams with the ball, working on Drummond. Mitchell kicks to Williams. Five to shoot. That's good. And of the last six baskets, five have come on the interior. This is major smash mouth basketball. Love it. Old school. Physical play in the pink. Dominate. Here's Mitchell, defended by Ball. Mitchell passes Pruman Young. He kicks it to Williams. And foul called as he misses. He'll go to the line and shoot two. This is the free throw. Olenek, he's checked in for Andre Drummond. No luck that time either. Maverick trailed by 10. He feeds it to Olenek. He passes the four. Puts up a three. A second chance effort. Here's four. And finally they hit one. I like the way they got the ball inside there. Grizzlies have gone three of four in field goal attempts since getting things started here in the fourth. Ande Takumbo kicks to Mitchell. Wow, and that sort of showmanship is just deflating right now to a Team trying hard to get back into this game like this. Yeah, definitely a jam with emphasis. A big apostrophe or exclamation point. How about maybe even a question mark, Mark? <laughs> well, you know what the questions are about now. It's their defense, that's for sure. Tatum, smooth as silk on the finger roll. Brought back the finger roll. That's a nice finesse move to pull off with the defense all over. Out of bounds, Dallas takes possession. Boy, just a brain cramp, guys. I mean, that should have been the simplest of exchanges. Mavericks trailed by nine. Long range from the inbound. The shot's good from Poole. He's got 24. 
Boy, he's putting up big numbers in that three-point column, guys. And a little over three and a half minutes in the books so far here in the fourth. Here's Andre Takumbo. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. And no question, he got bumped on that shot. Definitely no room for discussion on that one. That's good for Andre Takumbo. Kevin, right now, they're doing a good job at the line. They're, they're hovering around 83, 84, 85% from the strike. And that's good stuff. I mean, that's um, that's well done. Oh, free throw is good for Andre Takumbo. Mavericks trail by eight. Ball. He's guarded by Williams. Passes it to Ball. Launches it. It's rebounded by Memphis. On to Takumbo. has got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the glass. Oh, a nice defensive play to disrupt the alley-oop. Now the basket pool. With the shot. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Yeah, that's a low percentage shot right there. Yeah, it sure is. I mean, he's got to be thinking out there a little better. Make the pass in that situation. Don't force a bad shot. Williams passes coming up. Good. And a nice assist for Williams. Williams has got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Mavericks trail by 10. They set the screen. Tatum. No good. And the Grizzlies going the other way now. It's been a real difficult game for him offensively. And it's Foster. Mitchell off a bit from Andre Chikumbo. Mitchell's shot is good. And it's a 12-point Grizzly lead. They've done a lot of good work with the ball. Really moving both the, the ball and moving bodies, getting quality chances at the hoop. And they're not wasting chances when they get it. I mean, they're hitting their shots. From outside the arc, here's Eaton. And there's the bucket. Stay with it on the offensive glass, getting it done. Good job there, recognizing the mismatch and then just going straight up with the shot. He's got a major height advantage. It's Williams with the drive. The jump up. And this sure that one drops. And the Grizzlies lead by 12. There's been a change in this game compared to what we saw in the first half. And he's scoring with a lot of confidence now. Foul call. Looks like the D didn't get there in time. And he'll shoot free throws. Here. And he sinks the second. Here's Williams. Pass to Ronda de Kumbo. Timeout called the Grizzlies. Let's catch up with Doris from the sideline. Hey guys, over that last break, I was able to catch the message the Grizzlies head coach was giving to his team. He said we are this close to finishing them off, but the job is not done yet, and I don't want to see any let up out there. We'll see how well his point got across, guys. To the middle. It's Drummond with the rebound. Drummond's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. And he wheels that one in, sinking right through off the back iron. And the Grizzlies leading by nine. Williams kicks to Honda Takumba. Ball. He's guarded by Williams. There's Trump. Oh, I love it. Active hands on the steal. Active feet on the fast break. And Clark Power on the dunk. And guys, this is just too close of a game to be giving the ball up like that and then failing to get back in transition. Grizzlies have gone 7 of 9 from the field down the stretch here in the fourth quarter. Terrific shooting. Down low. Boom, he turns it straight down. Tell you what, he can do a lot more damage to that win than that. And you know, 
Park with the lead going drum. I'm surprised he didn't put on some extra on that one. Me too. Well, I think he did plenty of damage anyway. It was only with one hand, but he threw it down pretty hard. And you know that's going to be goaltending, guys. So that's a free basket right there. He didn't get to that one quite in time, Kevin. Those can be tough to gauge sometimes. And you can hear the reaction of the fans to that call. Well, it's obvious they did not like it, Steve. And that one's good. They've got to continue to put pressure on the defense by probing inside. That's what's really working for them. And when you're doing the job they are inside, it takes pressure off the perimeter guy. Grizzlies, their shooting has been fun to watch in this game. They're at 57 percent. Get Pella. The feet to Williams. He passes Romania. Get Pella. Stolen. Ball over past the bullet. Here's Fico. I think in that situation, there's a nice try to create some space for himself with the fadeaway. Austin Mitchell. Here's Andre Takumbo. There's the pick. Pass it coming up. Makes it off the glass. And the Grizzlies lead by nine. You know, the only tough part of that basket for him was getting into such good position. The rest of it seemed easy. The dish to Drummond. And there's the basketball. Six on the shot clock. And stolen by Williams. And now the Grizzlies face break. Here's Mitchell. And he draws body contact. Looked like a blocking foul. And he was uh, in the shooting motion. So he'll head to the free throw line. the fact that they're getting to the line and on top of that they're making their free throws in this half that bodes well going forward he's perfect from the line this time as a team they're hovering around 86 to 87 percent from the line that's exactly what you want to see i mean converting at that rate that'll win you a lot of games dallas calls timeout Trailed by 11. Pass the ball. A good finish at the rack off the slick feed. He's got 21. He is setting this place on fire, fellas. This shooting has been off the charts. Mitchell passes Coleman in. The late missed. Well, those chances are almost always two points for him. I, I guess the defense did what it had to do to bother. For three. They get it again. Boy, they're doing a nice job, a really good job of getting second chances here. And that's a, that's a great way to cut into that lead. I mean, nothing is more demoralizing to a defense than put that. Here's Hunter to Kumbo. Williams passes Kumbo. Here's Andre Tacumbo. Get power. It's Drummond with the rebound. Drummond's got rebound number 13 with that last one. And the Mavericks call time here. 
They're trailing by seven. 136 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Six left to play here in the fourth. Taken away by Williams. They're starting to go in the wrong direction in terms of turnovers. It's slowly becoming a problem here. Williams gets a screen from Mitchell. They set the pick. And looks like the illegal pick was set. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. Well, an illegal screen is one of the toughest calls for the official to make. You know, I agree with you. You've got to have some sympathy for the referees when they have to make calls like that. But they get paid well, and they're the best in the business, so they can handle it. Tatum. That's good. Now, just a five-point Grizzly lead. The Grizzly shooting has been just great so far, up at 56%. Here's Mitchell. And right through it goes. Mitchell's got nine points now in the quarter. Dallas has gone into a funk from downtown in the fourth round. One of their five three-pointers has found the bottom of the bucket. In a solid outing for Drummond. He's got 13 rebounds and two blocks. Excellent defensive presence on the glass. And delivering some of that shot blocking skill, too. Yeah, a dominant performance in the paint. First free throw missing for him. We'll see if he can nail the second. And the second of two is good. That turns the lead to six. He needed to cash in on all of those. And missed opportunities at the line are the last thing they need right now. Here is Andre Tukumbo, defended by Drummond. And so he draws the foul on the shot. A trip to the line to shoot two. seconds left in the fourth quarter and they go to the intentional foul first free throw is good and that makes it a seven point lead
good from Ball. And so they choose to intentionally foul. Cushion. And the Mavericks call time here. They're down by seven. We've got 22 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Guys, what do you think? Well, they can game plan all they want, but there's not enough time left for them to come back and win this game. Yeah, I'm not quite sure exactly what they think they're going to pull off here. And it's a completely new group on the floor for the Mavericks. We've got 22 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And here's Walker outside. It's in! And now they trail by just four. And they're going to prolong the game here with an intentional foul. Yeah, you got to freeze the clock. I mean, that's the enemy in this situation. A few misses at the line, and they're in good shape. making a change here. Steve Kerr and Doris Burke. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for tuning in to the NBA Western Conference semifinals here on 2K Sports. And now, Jordan presents your player of the game.